Cheers, everybody. Welcome to another beer review. And in this one, we've got an Irish beer, Wafto Haras in Carlo in Ireland. And we have got a smooth and creamy nitro Irish red from them coming in a 440ml can. And it's at 4.3% ABV. This was picked up from the bear and bottle. I've had it for over a month. And same ABV as the nitro stout. So, what can I say to you about an Irish red? Well, I think it's an Irish red for me. It's like an interpretation of, say, a Bach beer in a way. It's 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 their way of putting an Irish spin on it. So, let's crack it open like you do. There we go. And let's pour it out. There we go. Cat's looking at me saying, what the bloody hell is that noise? That soon woke you up, didn't it? So what do I think of nitro beers? Oh, you know. Style over substance for me, to be honest. It's 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 nitro beers for me. They're not, you know, they look great, don't they? Look at it. Um, when you pour them, they look a picture. Look a picture. But for me, I think you sacrifice flavour in nitro beers. That's just my own opinion. Um, I know that Guinness have got that nitro surge out. Um, by the time you see this, I don't know if I'll get one or not. Um, I haven't really thought about it, to be honest, because I think it's one of them things which I don't drink a lot of Guinness, so is it worth me buying one just to do a video for? Anyway, get back to this. We're not talking about Guinness, we're talking about Harvest. Um, Look at that. It does look good. Irish red, nice, thick, solid, creamy head you would expect from a nitro beer. Right, let's get the aroma. Yeah, hint of malt. Yeah, hint of grain. There's a hint of, say, a toffee or whole grain there behind it. It's, yeah, I mean, it smells okay. Um, I'm just going to go in. So, happy St. Patrick's Day. Cheers, everyone. It's everything I expect out of a nitro. The body is light, fluffy, in a way, it's very, you know, the aeration of it all is very fluffy. It's very smooth, easy drinking. The flavour, it has got a little bit of flavour to it for a nitro. It's a hint of grain for me. There's a hint of um, slight berryness there, slight sourness there, slight bitterness there, um, but it's, 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 it's this nitro thing, and it is, some people like nitro beers, but it gets to the point that the body of the beer is so light, if you had a few of these beers, you won't even realise you're drinking it. Um, and it's not, you know, it has got a little bit of flavour, but it's not big on flavour. It's, 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 it feels like the nitro for me has, has diminished the flavour in a way. It's similar to, to say, anything with a widget in, or it's, 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 it's kind of like a diminishment, a diminishment in taste, if you know what I mean. But is it bad? No, it's not bad. It's easy drinking. Smooth, yeah, light as marshmallow. Um, slight grainy feel to it. Sessionable, yeah, I can imagine in Ireland this would be their John Smith's in a way they go to. Uh, I can't see him drinking John Smith's in Ireland, can you? But actually, the beer, O'Hara's, 
the ones I've had. This is about the third, this is third or fourth on the channel. They've all been all right. And this is this is no exception. Easy drinking, you know, not big in flavour. It goes down a treat, really. So there's nothing really crit critical about it. It's a nitro beer. What did I expect? Um in 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 texture and flavour. So nothing surprises me. It's it's what I expected, but you know, it's one of the better ones, definitely. Definitely one of the better ones. So O'Hara's Irish Red Nitro Nitro Irish Red, so I say. Um yeah, give it give it a go. Tell me what I think. It's you know, like I say, easy drinking fodder. And yeah, not bad at all, really. Thank you very much for watching this one. There's a hint of sweetness to it as well. See you on my next one. Bib bib.